Hey guys, I thought I should just give you a little bit of background before we get into the video. Um, so I moved out of my flat a few months ago and into this house share uh, where there's actually four chickens and a cat. And when I first moved in, it was just me looking after these animals. And while I learned the basics of feeding them, letting them out, collecting the eggs, um, making sure a fox doesn't eat them, I actually was like low-key scared of the chickens and didn't exactly love them. Uh, so in this video I thought I would not only introduce you to them but just face my fears a bit and try and pick one up and yeah learn to love them as my housemates now do um, but yeah I hope you enjoy this video it's good fun and it's quite different from my usual videos so let me know if you'd like to see more things like this um, yeah without further ado I'll let the video carry on voice over sounds going going gone bye Hello, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for clicking on another video. In today's video, I thought I would introduce you to my four chickens and cat, which is very exciting. Whether or not the cat will be introduced is completely up to her. Her name is Miu Miu. She does what she wants. She appears when she wants. So I can't really guarantee that she will cooperate in this video. However, the chickens tend to be more predictable. Apologies, I'm so ridiculously sweaty. Uh, I did just do a pretty intense leg workout. I will link that in the description of this video once that's up. We have a special guest on the channel who I will be introducing you to shortly. My housemate Anna who is just like the chicken wizard and magician. I'm just gonna go and get changed super quickly out of my very sweaty clothes. We have Alabaga! Yes! <laughs> I have <a> full name! <laughs> yes! We have Anna who is my lovely housemate. I'm gonna introduce you to our chickens. I think we can call them our chickens now. I think there are chickens. I think after a certain amount of time of cleaning something's poo. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we've kept them alive. We fed them, we've kept them alive yeah. and ate their eggs, which I think makes us pretty intimate with these chickens. <laughs> and Anna's basically like the chicken wizard. She loves them. I do love she them. She calls them cute. They are cute, Sarah. You have to really, you need to crouch down and look into their eyes. No, I don't. They kill me. Look into their eyes. They're so eyes. aggressive. They're super aggressive. And I don't love them. Um, I feel like when I first moved in and I had to look after them on my own, because it was just me for the first like, three weeks, um, they were just really, they would never go to bed on time and I love an early night. And so they just stressed me out. So I'm really glad to be living with this wonderful human. It's like, one of them's face is looking pretty puffy. What do we do? And I'm like, well, I don't know. Wait and see. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, um, two very different chicken taking. Sarah's people. already looked up how much it costs to get another chicken. <laughs> should we lose one? You gotta be practical about these things. Twenty yeah, pounds. Yeah, right? twenty twenty-five. Yeah, it's not bad. Yeah. Because <laughs> um, our deposit literally rides on it. So anyway, um, <laughs> without further ado. Let's introduce you to the chickens. So there are four of them, they're outside in one of the gardens. Um, and <laughs> I've never held one or picked one up. Anna's gonna kindly try and teach me yeah. how to do that. Not that I'm a full on expert on handling chickens. She is an expert, you guys. If any of you know that, leave so. an angry comment. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> no, she's, um, she's really good with them, so I'm gonna try and not be scared Can and pick it. up a chicken. So yeah. Without further ado, oh, let's go outside. Wheat kernels, and um, in this one is barley kernels, which kind of look similar. Uh, apparently, they really like them as a little treat. Ah, Maybe nice. Sarah will eat some to the chickens from her hand. <laughs> <laughs> I might throw some at them. Um, <laughs> fetch, go fetch. They like playing fetch, right? Uh, sure. <laughs> so, as soon as you come out of the house, the chickens literally just flock to you because they expect food. What do you want to do first? Do you want to do pick one up? Or I think pick one up, okay, because then they won't expect food, right? Yeah, that's a good point. They're going to be really interested in that. Okay. Okay. Are you doing this? Sarah, Sarah <laughs> when you pick up a chicken, choose a chicken, <laughs> and just crouch down and be like, hello chicken. And then you just want to get your hand. So they do that, which is they think you're like a rooster. You want to grab their wings and like under their legs. And then you just pick them up and you're holding their wings. <laughs> and they're really comfy. Oh, okay. He doesn't look comfy. I mean, it's not their favorite. Show them. <laughs> Show them. This is the chicken. Uh, his feet. This is either Kim, Chris, or. <laughs> what is it? Not named by me. Chris, but Kim, look, how Kylie, is that cute? Look at his and eyes. the other one. 
And his beak, he's dangerous. Hi. Oh. Hi. He's so oh. cute. Okay, downtime. <laughs> oh, no, no, I'm not doing it. I'm Maybe doing it. try a different one this time. So you don't want to go for this one? I would, yeah. So if you so just like crouch side. down, and then as soon as you sort of <laughs> go to pick her up, she'll probably like do the crouching thing. <laughs> No, it's fine. You've got gloves on, you'll be fine. Yeah, but what do I do? I just kind of... So you want to you get the wings, otherwise what you'll get is a flapping chicken in your hand, which okay. is quite um, shocking. <laughs> that's oh. what that's I told you that she does what she wants. Come say hi. Oh, I feel a sense of adrenaline. <laughs> like he survived oh. something quite, uh, yeah, quite intense. Okay. <laughs> oh, they're quite, uh, they're quite it's aggressive. It's actually harder to do it with gloves on, I think, because they tend to grab the gloves. Okay, I'm here. Ow, ow. ow. ooh, ooh. Interesting. It's okay, isn't it? It's not too bad. This one has a runny butt. <laughs> There is something the fact wrong that you know that oh. is concerning. They just peck at your hand. Should we give them some wheat? <laughs> Can't believe I held a chicken, Anna. Oh, this is major. Do you want to do the wheat one? Or? Yes, please. Oh, I don't think I hate them anymore. <laughs> Isn't that interesting? <laughs> Why are you saying that sarcastically? Because now are you like, oh, they can't hurt me. Yeah, they're not too bad. Okay. You're not the worst things ever. Can I script What happens if I stroke it? Will they hurt um, me? They'll tolerate it. They won't hurt you. They won't peck you. Oh my gosh, they're not that bad. <laughs> Ow, okay, chill. Oh, wow. You can try stroke one really gently, just on oh, their wing or on their back. What happens when I do that? They'll either crouch down like they did before, or they'll just walk away. Mm. Try it. Yeah, they're, <laughs> they're not too fussed on them. Oh my gosh, I don't hate them anymore. Well, they're still annoying, but I'm not scared of them. But they so, like, what do you beck me for? Back up, there's nothing in there. Look at that, uh, do you see how like, they proper engage eye contact with you though, they right? Do. I find that intimidating and rude. <laughs> I think that's bad manners. You should never stare someone in the eye. Okay, I'm gonna try and pick one up again. Okay. Oh wait, same height, right? Yeah, I would say don't pick up, um, don't pick up this one with the, so she doesn't have a white collar. Okay. Uh, just because I think she's not very well, so I'll try not to pick her up. Okay, good show. I don't know you could tell them apart like that. Well, the other three have white collars, so... Okay. No, chill out. Oh, did I do this again? Uh, their wings, right? Yeah, so hold their wings and grab the underneath their belly. <laughs> or their rib cage. <laughs> <gasps> Perfect! You got it! Good chicken! She's well falling. Shall I throw it? No! <laughs> there you go. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. You're coming. A chicken convert. <laughs> Chickens absolutely love watermelon. They literally love it. So if we... Oh, where do I put it? If I put that there... They just love it. It's, that's kind of cute. I get it. Yeah? Oh, I don't want to get it, but I do get it. Why? Yeah, they're just little, they're just little friends. It's so cute how much they love the watermelon. Oh my gosh! So when they sit on the bench, I can actually just put them back inside. Yeah. Um, I should explain that. They have to go in the coop at night because if they don't and they stay outside, a fox could eat them. Theoretically speaking. Um, sometimes though, they just don't go back in their coop. They will just sit on this this, this, this little bench over there, like by there. You like can see it. Gargoyle's head. Literally, yeah. <laughs> And they'll just sit on it. And so for me, I was like, absolutely not. Whereas Anna would pick them up and put them in the coop. So now, I can pick them up and put them in the coop and know that they're not going to peck my eye out. So, <laughs> that's progress, friends. <laughs> oh, that's lovely. Thank you for teaching me. Oh, you're welcome. Oh, goodness me, you should be a YouTuber. You're a natural at this. I mean... <laughs> okay, so what have you got there, Anna? So 
here we've got um, some mixed grit. Apparently it's very high quality pebbles. <laughs> um, and some oyster shell, uh, which is good for giving them sort of a calcium supplement, I guess. Mm. Um, so we give those to them over here. Anna and Gina figures this out. I... <laughs> we were worried about the one that always has the runs. Yeah. Turns out she just always has and... I don't know, it's hard to tell what's specifically wrong with a chicken, so... But we thought maybe this would help anyway. Um, so usually you put it separate to the food as like an optional thing. So that's the oyster shell, quite pretty. And then the grit is literally... So Gina bought this and when we got it, I was like, you do realise that's literally just little stones. <laughs> <laughs> we paid for them. Yeah. But they do eat it, so I guess they like it. <laughs> Yeah. They definitely seem health, like healthy chickens. They do. They got beautiful. They're so like personally, I found them just really beautiful. Yeah, their colour just going for food. <laughs> Watermelon. One thing I do kind of know how to do is collect the eggs. So they usually lay one each per day. The dodgy chicken makes her mind up on whether she does. Um, but they have re the eggs are really good. Like fresh eggs taste better than shop bought eggs, 100%. And we had, when we first moved in, why did that stop? When we first moved in, we had double yokers all the time. Mm. Why is that not happening anymore? I don't know. Um, and it starts to get colder and I think um, they start to get less light, they'll produce less eggs anyway. Ah, I see. Um, but I don't know, she's just a dodgy chicken. Yeah. <laughs> um, they will lay like at different times of the day. They do have like a separate place to lay eggs, but generally they'll leave them in here with all of the chicken poop, which I find absolutely disgusting. <laughs> but I can power through. Oh, it's relatively clean actually, and there's not too much poop in there today. That's some nice new hay bedding Gina got for them. Oh really? <laughs> Gina is fully financially investing she really in is. the lives of these chickens. <laughs> I'm more of like a keep alive and tolerate kind of girl. But yeah, full of fresh eggs, which mm. will make delicious omelette, fried egg, whatever you want. I've been baking a lot with them, which is cool. <laughs> um, yeah, that's basically the lives of these chickens summed up in one video. Um, I think we can, can we end it there? They eat their own eggs sometimes. It's very gross. It's really disgusting. So I can't actually put these down to yeah. say bye to you guys. But I'm gonna end the video there. I think we can end it there. Yeah. That is the life of these chickens. We have chickens. This is this is Anna. If you want to see her on the channel again, just let me know in the comments because um, she lives with me, so she can't escape my requests this at the is moment. True. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, give the video a thumbs up, let Anna know if she should start her own chicken channel. I think people would, t I would tune in for that. Um, but yeah, thanks so much for watching. I will see you in my next video, you guys. Bye. Love you so much. Bye. <laughs> Bye.